My name is Nikki. I'm an English makeup artist and I live with Carlo and our daughter Sky in Positano, Italy. Our house is far from the road but surrounded by fruit trees and olive groves and we grow our own food. We'll show you what it's really like to live on the Amalfi Coast. Subscribe and welcome to the Positano Diaries. Hello everywhere. Hello everybody. <laughs> Siamo stati invitati da mio cugino Peppe, il Fabbro. E come l'anno scorso, non so, mi sembra che era agosto sì, sì, però sì. l'anno scorso. Era più caldo. Sì, era agosto. Andremo a mangiare una pizza. Pizza, pizza night and it's a family pizza night, so you get to meet the whole family, well, not the whole family, but quite a lot of the family. Vabbè, eh almeno quelli family. più giovani che ce la fanno ancora a fare le scale. Yeah. Anyway, we're late, so let's get going. Stiamo accendendo il forno per portarla a 250 gradi per poi cuocere la pizza. Se no la pizza non si cuoce. La verità, uno, forse non ho la passione di cucinare, la cucina. Solo vedo che è così e capisco che a questo uomo si sbaglia. So here is the pizza dough all boxed up in trays. There you go. There's some wholemeal pizzas in there as well. So that's quite a lot of pizzas. And this is quite a large table. Che la vedete là? Cosa vedete là? Ma ce l'avete un pochino? Ma ce l'avete un pochino? Tanti saluti a tutti, sono Giuseppe, stick per gli amici. E sei il fratello di? Carlo. Ah! Sono l'altro uno di Carlo's brothers, Stefano. Ehi, ho già fatto una prima messa. Però mi Summertime in mid July when the sea seems to meet the sky and over be it five hundred come rolling in to town, loving you all the
miei amici. <ride> Dovete andare di là, non c'è il ma forza di là. Come on, girl. Go away. No? Go away. Hey. Chicken? Potatoes. I came down to the beach on purpose to take a guarantee for my watch to the watch shop because it needs to be repaired and I have got all the way down here and the guarantee for the watch is sitting on the kitchen table back home. So that's a complete fail. Signs of middle age. The next few days are going to be pretty busy. We've got people coming to stay. Um, some of you might know them but I'll wait until they arrive to show you who they are and we're gonna be taking them around and showing them a few things. Hopefully we'll have a boat trip and probably a kayak excursion and it should be pretty fun. I'm currently waiting for them up at the beginning of Monte Petuso. It's a little bit complicated because they've got a van and we've got to find somewhere to park it, which is always an absolute nightmare in this town. But hopefully they're on their way. I can see a van working its way up here, might be them. And I'm gonna take them a bit further up because Carlo and I went to scout out some parking spaces yesterday. I think this is them. <laughs> There's a minivan. Oh. <laughs> Ciao! Ciao. <laughs> I've now got a severe case of helmet hair. Wonderful. It's always a bit of a palaver getting down to our house. They have taken everything they need out of the camper van and we are now ferrying them down one by one from where they've parked to the top of my steps. They've got quite a lot of stuff that they're bringing down. They might have forgotten that they've got to carry it all back up again afterwards. And I've got my shopping here as well, so we're going down fully loaded. back down on the beach and we are with Sarah and Luca who are busy making their little videos. We're now going to sit down and introduce you properly to them because I know some of you will know exactly who they are and some of you won't and they've got a very interesting story so we will sit down and talk to you about that. Un giorno mi porti con te. Quando vuoi a disposizione. Facciamo solo fare un video di un giorno nella vita di Simone. Va bene, però è meglio a settembre. Se ne andiamo. As I mentioned before, it's very easy to get sidetracked in Positano. We have been down at the beach probably for about two hours now and we were going to come down here and introduce Sara and Luca and they were going to introduce us on their video 
and we've done everything but. Um, they have spent an hour with one of the local fishermen and they're now talking about Neapolitan words, I think, with Paolo. Pago io. No, pago io. Pago io. Pago io. Pavia, pavia, pago io. We're trying to film different videos so that we haven't got the same thing on each channel and hopefully we'll manage that but we've just secured a boat for tomorrow so tomorrow we're taking them out for a boat trip along the Amalfi Coast. Yes. So for the next few days we are with Sarah and Luca and they have a very interesting story. They were travelling. Tell me all about it. Okay, so our channel is called Liu Live Everything and Wonder and we quit our job in 2017 and we decided to explore the American continent from Alaska to Argentina and we did it so with an old truck camper we were able to drive the entire Pan American highway from Northern Point in Alaska that horse to the southern Point in Ushuaia, Argentina. And uh, we wanted to prove that it's possible to travel on a low budget, so we did a $800 uh, truck camper. We had managed to live on the road for over three years uh, and to accomplish the entire Pan American Highway. Wow. And uh, you know, yeah. over 300 and plus videos on our YouTube channel, we documented all our expedition, our adventure. Yeah, we, we love to share beautiful places, but we love to share the reality of traveling and extreme traveling. So, no luxury for us, and it was quite adventurous. <laughs> What's that? And we would like to inspire people and say to them, if you are not happy in your life, you want to change direction, job, career, love, you can do it. So it is possible to travel on a budget, it's possible to travel and explore a continent, the entire American continent with an old vehicle, but yeah, so we are pretty happy. And what are your plans this year? This year? Yeah. Oh, 2020 and 2021 are the no plans years. So, <laughs> It's yeah. very, very difficult, but we would like to explore more our beautiful country, Italy. Mm -hmm. That's why we're here today yeah. with you guys. <laughs> yes, because when the pandemic hit, we were first, uh, we had to come back to Italy and we converted a little van that we had here that now is called Luigi. And uh, it happens to bring us just here in Positano and, uh, and stay a few days uh, with Carlo and Niki. And, uh, Yes. We always love to show the less touristic place, so probably you are saying why you are in Pusitano. <laughs> it's like the most touristic the most. place in Italy. <laughs> but showing to the people that there is another side of the story, yeah. just one side. Yeah. Yeah. So, and I think it's perfect to visit with the locals, with people yeah. that are yeah. living in the oh, town. Oh yeah, it no always lot. makes it more interesting because yeah. you see the real side to exactly. it. Exactly. Yeah. Hello everywhere, beautiful people. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, we, we talked meet. about this last okay. night. Hello, beautiful people, people everywhere. everywhere. <laughs> That's perfect. yesterday we've rented out a boat for the day now I just wanted to touch on this because some of you may be wondering why aren't we going out on one of Elizabeth's boats well today we're going out and our main reason for going out is to show Sarah and Luca the Amalfi Coast from the sea and of course they want to make videos we want to make videos and if we went on one of Elizabeth's boat trips there would be other passengers on board that we would have to take into consideration yeah that possibly would not want to be filmed in swimwear. So we decided the best thing to do would be to rent just a little wooden rowboat, not a rowboat, a bit more than a rowboat, a little wooden boat with an engine and just pass her along the coast slowly ourselves. So that's what we're gonna to do today. 
Um, I'm on my way down to make sandwiches for everybody. We're going to have a picnic on board. I'm going to go to the delicatessen and do that. And in the meantime, Carlo is taking Sarah and Luca up to the hole in Monte Petuso. Uh, Luca saw it on his way up yesterday and wanted to visit. So they've gone to do that. Ciao. Siamo qui con Sara e Luca. Hi everywhere. Hi everywhere. <laughs> e questi sono i miei cittadini, i miei compaesani. Ciao. 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 And now we are going up there to visit the hole, the rock. Niki, where are you? Niki, we will see you soon. Yeah, she, she's going to town and preparing lunch for later, some sandwiches. <laughs> because we will go on a tour. Stay tuned. Sì, adesso andiamo. Luca, Sara. Whoa. Guarda qui. Wow. Siamo arrivati. We made it. Al buco. Questa è la veduta su Monte Pertuso. Andiamo a vedere cosa c'è oltre il buco. Positano è laggiù. Buco, facciamo passare il drone in questo buco. Sì, sì, sì. Sì, sì lo dobbiamo andare. fare. Sì. I am in the delicatessen. I love coming here for lunch. They have such a great selection. Let me show you what they've got. Ciao. <laughs> We uh, ask oil for choice here. Uh, Look at all of that. What should we have for lunch? And the best thing is, they cater for everybody because Sky is vegetarian, none of us really eat much meat. Pamela's coming, Sky's friend, and she is celiac, so we've got food for everybody. And we don't have to have sandwiches, we've got all sorts of other yummy stuff, even pasta. Let me quickly show you the view from the pasta aisle. It is quite an impressive amount of pasta for such a small shop, but the view is even more impressive. This will be my next step. Dio quanto è più grande. Ce l'hai più grosso? Luca. <laughs> Lui ce l'ha più grande. Luca, you can speak in English. Okay. <laughs> you can this translate. Is the next drone uh, Carlo would like to, to buy, the upgrade. Uh, yeah. And he's saying that uh, mine is bigger. <laughs> <laughs> It's true. <laughs> here Italians Italy, always thinking yes, about we, here in Italy things. we love to to do these kind of jokes. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Which drone do you, do you have, Carlo? Che, che drone hai? Uh, mini 2. Mini 2. Mini 2, sì. And this one, Luca, is? It's the 2 Pro. 2 Pro, so it's bigger. So we made it to the hall of uh, Monte, Monte Pertuso. Monte Pertuso. <laughs> Monte Pertuso significa Monte con il buco. Ah, Pertuso è buco? Sì. So ah. Pertuso is hole, Monte With the hole, is yeah. uh, mount, so this is Mount uh, Hole. Yeah. The mount with a hole, the something with like the hole, this. Mountain. Bello, vedi questo non l'abbiamo detto. And guys, this is something incredible. It looks like Archie's National Park in the United States. And on But the other with side, the view of the sea. And now, cosa facciamo? What are we going to do next? Uh, now we go uh, to the beach. Okay. Or uh, rent a boat and go to the sea. Wow! wow. Yes. yes. <laughs> Ok, andiamo! Yes! Let's go! Let's go. Eravamo lassù! I'm sort of regretting offering to come and get lunch. I have got so much to carry down. I've got two sets of flippers uh, and masks. I've got my camera, I've got my beach bag, I've got four bowls of salad, I've got two bowls of pasta, a fruit bowl, two bo big bottles of water, and a dog on a lead. <laughs> At least I'm nearly down. Come tutto solo? Uno, due, tre, quattro, cinque, sei, cinque, sei. No, fornillo, fornillo. Ok, ne sto So, if you've seen us do this before, you will know that right now we are just going from the jetty to pick up the boat that we're going to use on today, which is moored out at sea. Ok, 
So on board today we have one verified captain. Hello. <laughs> we have one captain in training. <laughs> Thanks to her boyfriend. And we have one Mozzo. <laughs> which means which means? Mozzo is a uh, uh, basic level. Oh basic level, okay. Yeah, yeah. No license, but he knows no how to license. drive a boat. No. Over there on that uh, white house with the green uh, window was uh, Sophia Lawrence's house. And that is how the videos are made. <laughs> got a piece of netting wrapped around the propeller. Yeah. Carla's trying to undo it. Non manco la rete, è proprio un Yeah, it's the um, the netting that gets put over the lemon trees. It must have blown off with a strong wind. Okay. Okay, that's definitely not a good thing to have floating in the sea. why there's a box of masks on the table. We don't really need them. <laughs> For dinner, we're having masks. No, we have got, <laughs> the cookies have nothing to do with dinner either. We have got um, mozzarella melted on lemon leaves. We've got veggie burgers. We've got chicken burgers. We've got potato salad and various toppings for the burgers. Easy peasy. Buon appetito. Buon appetito. Buon appetito. So this arrived yesterday 
and I still haven't opened it. Same, è oro, quanto We've vale? We've been waiting since February for this. Ma la stai prendendo al contrario? Ma sei terribile, io non capisco. La lettera. Ta-da! Dai, ti vedo fuori. Ma che vuol dire che Congratulations! 100.000! Ma ah, io pensavo che era d'oro, questo è di? No, argento! argento. Oro, un milione, non, non è vero. Non arriva mai, mai, mai. Ma poi se sei più di Python, le cose persone anni fa dicevate, dicevate che non arriveremo mai a 100.000. Eh. Sì, è vero. If each of your subscribers was a light year, they could take you from one side of the Milky Way to the other. That's far. I won't read anymore because they're going to get one soon. <laughs> Maybe in one year. Who knows? <laughs> right. Now we have to decide where to put it. I don't like that one. See? Outside the house. <laughs> <laughs> yeah.